Hi guys, welcome to Jurassic Collectibles. I hope you're all enjoying the holiday season. If you haven't already, please make sure you enter the competition on the main page. You could be in for winning the Blu-ray trilogy of Jurassic Park, as well as a brochure replica and a Hollywood clapper board. So if you haven't already, check that out. Today we're going to be looking at quite a, a unique item, actually. It comes all the way from Japan, and it's this. It's the Lost World official soundtrack. Um, and it comes with an extra here, it comes with a Tamagotchi, um, which is included in the pack. And also the soundtrack packaging um, boasts something that it calls the 3D diorama, um, which wasn't available here in the UK. I'm not sure if it was available in the States as well, but as far as I can tell, it's a bit of a sort of a Japanese exclusive, and they always seem to get these nice exclusives, these box sets that have way more things than we can get in the Western world. So, um, yeah, let's have a little look at this. You can see that the label is quite old. I'm not sure if this is because it's been in storage since 1997. But it has got the Lost World logo there and some lettering there, Japanese lettering. And then you've got the um, Lost World um, Tamagotchi. I'm not sure if it's official Lost World, but it just says dinosaurs. And it's got this sort of black rock texturing going around. And then you've got the Lost World official soundtrack by John Williams himself. Got some nice Japanese lettering. I love the way that this contrasts the the uh, the US lettering, the English. Um, it's quite nice to have that down the side. Then on the back, you've got um, a T-Rex here, and then you've got some information about the track listings. Um, I'm not sure if this is the diorama. It looks like it might be. But let's get this thing out of the packaging and have a closer look. Okay, so out of the packaging we have the soundtrack itself, which is um, sealed um, in plastic. Then we have the uh, Tamagotchi, so let's get a closer look. Now it's out of the packaging. Uh, you can see it's kind of like a fake fossil effect going around the outside. And we will be turning this one on in a minute to see what it looks like. There we go. Um, it also came with this sleeve. I thought this might be the diorama, but it seems to be um, sort of just a a sleeve to go inside the packaging and here we've just got some fire um, and it's got some little bits of information about the Tamagotchi there let's have a look so these were all the rage around sort of the late 90s um, they were really popular can't get it to focus there we go so it says pterosaurs parasaurolophus and tyrannosaurus rex um, I'm a little bit suspicious about the Tyrannosaurus Rex. It looks more like a Diplodocus, if you ask me. Um, but there we go. And then inside, have we got any information? Nope, that's plain. And then we've got here the instructions for the Tamagotchi itself. So I won't bore you too much with that, but just to show you what's inside. Okay, let's get the soundtrack out of its packaging. Okay, so here's the Lost World out of its packaging, and the um, the piece with the Japanese lettering on it kind of conveniently slides off. So I'm wondering if this was available in the US. If it was, let me know. Um, I think I prefer the plastic case, but um, this one's kind of like um, a cardboard, a matte cardboard. And as you open it up, we've got a little slide-out insert um, from MCA Universal, and that's got some advertising for um, other music that's available on soundtracks it's all in Japanese and a little send away um, uh, postcard there it's been in storage for quite a long time so it's covered in this sort of um, uh, sort of like mold in a way <laughs> it's, it's, it's been stored for quite a long time so um, it's obviously been stored somewhere a little bit damp so um, yeah so here inside you can see we've got a cutout of a Parasaurolophus. Now, I believe what you do is you take these and you fold them over, so you punch these out. But I'm going to attempt doing this off camera in a minute, just to give you an overview of the packaging. So, here we go, we've got the Lost World Jurassic Park, and we've got the Baby Stegosaurus. The CD is inserted here, and then you've got the Jurassic Park gates. Which is kind of funny because actually the Jurassic Park gates have nothing to do with the Lost World, but still. And then you've got um, two raptors there. And then I think if you open this up, you've got a T Rex somewhere, if I'm not mistaken. I do remember seeing a T Rex. There it is. It's 
So underneath the baby stegosaurus is a T-Rex. So what I'm going to do is get these all unfolded and punched, and I'll show you what the 3D diorama looks like. On the back we've just got track listings. So I'll be back in just a second. So here's the completed diorama, and I have to say it's pretty impressive considering this is just CD packaging. Um, so we've got the Parasaurolophus there, the baby Stegosaurus, we've got the Jurassic Park gates, and then here we've got two raptors stalking their prey. And then at the back there, towering over everything, we've got the T-Rex. I'll just give you a closer look at each section. So, there we go, there's the Parasaurolophus, and the way they work is these little tabs at the base of the ferns there uh, folds inwards and locks into place with another tab that folds up from the base. And, um, yeah, it's quite sturdy. I mean, I think it would be quite nice if I had um, action figures to stand in this diorama, because it would actually make quite a nice backing if you're looking for a diorama, because I'm not too aware of many Jurassic Park or Lost World dioramas. I think this might actually be a first. Um, so it's quite interesting to note that. So maybe you're looking for a setting for your action figures. They might be a little bit big for the for the setting, but I think it would still work as a sort of a, a rainforest background. Um, and short of you building one of your own, this might be a an easy solution. So here's the Tamagotchi, and as you can see it's got this little peel off screen. So I'm going to take that off, and then in the side it's got a little tab, and when I take that out it should be activated. Okay, now. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. So there's our, our baby dinosaur. Um, it looks like it's kind of sat next to a giant sundae, and it, it could be a dinosaur, could be a snake. Is that all I'm going to get out of this? Okay. So, I do have to remember that this is very, very old. Uh, this has been around since 1997, and it may be that I need to press the reset button a few times, or the battery might actually have corroded in that time. But there we go. It was exciting while it lasted. I enjoyed that. And you guys saw it too. Um, I don't think it's an officially bland... Oh, oh there we go. It's back to life again. But yeah, I'm going to have a little play with this and see what I can get out of it. But um, it's not an official Jurassic Park branded product. And uh, I'm sure Japan was pumping these things out at the time of the Tamagotchi popularity. Um, but still, it's nice that you get this included as an extra freebie. And it makes the um, the set of interest, um, just because it's so unique. So there we have it, the Japanese Lost World official soundtrack complete with Tamagotchi and 3D diorama. What do you guys think? Would you like to use this as a diorama for your figures? Let me know. And if you haven't already, make sure you enter the competition on the main channel page. Um, I'll be announcing the winners tomorrow. Rate, comment and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.